Hey, you guys, guess what time of day it is? It is down the tree time for you all. Hello, my friends and family. Look at the background. It's not the way we wanted it. We thought it would be in one direction. It's going both directions, I guess. I don't know. It's my owls, my owl friends, tablecloth that we got from, I think, Walmart. Yeah. Anyways, hello. How are you? What's new? Give me the 411. Bonnie, where have you been, girl? I heard from you in a while. What's going on? Um, let's see. What do I want to tell you guys? I don't know. There's not a whole lot to talk about right now. I feel like I'm forgetting something, but anyways, you guys, I got, you know, a lot to show you today, and I want to get right into this haul, if you don't mind. Hit the bell in the corner and let you know when I upload a video for me or me and the hubs or the hubs by himself because we're going to get the hubs back doing it too. Mark my words. So let's get into this haul, you all. Okay. The first thing I, if you all noticed, ever since the pandemic hit, we the light bulbs at Dollar Tree just, I mean, used to have tons of light bulbs, right? Now it's down to nothing. Well, then I see that they had this Cree. Uh, it's one bulb, 75 watt replacement. So pick that up. And then the three-way lights they had. And these things, you go get a three-way light bulb at like Myers or Walmart. They're upwards of $15 plus. And they're a three-way light. I like to use that in my craft area. Okay. And then they brought back the sunbeam. I know people have their mixed emotions on the sunbeam, but... This is a four pack and this is 60 watt. Yes. So I got two. There we go. All right, so there's that. Uh, I don't feel like I want something else out here. Let me see. Just one memento, you guys. One memento, and I'll be right with you, crap. I'm just looking for something I'm not seeing, but that's okay. All right. All right, here it is. I found it. I found someone. Okay, so. Let's go to this side. So, I am doing a treasure chest for the lake house. And this is for the little kids. This is a splash and swim Mud Master Splash Ring. Looks like that. Give them something to play with in the water. Then I bought some more masks to have in the car. I know most doctor's offices and things like that are not saying to not have the mask, but I just want to make sure I have some. So there you go. <clears throat> then they brought these back, and this is the Wall Decor Mural, which I use it for backdrop. And this is 42 inch by 72 inch. Looks like that. And then this one is fun too. And this is of the sea turtles. Yep, that'll be fun to do. Okay. All right, let's get these out of the way. I got these for a purpose. This is the Tool Bench brand wall mount wire rack. Okay. This is going to go in my bedroom. I got two of them. Okay. And this is going to hang up all. My paparazzi um, jewelry that I, I got a really good deal on some paparazzi, a dollar a thing. So I got this one. It has earrings on these ones. Um, but I need something, some place to put my, hang my necklaces because I don't want them all tangled up. We're going to try this. Okay. <clears throat> okay, okay. Here we go. We got some more stuff for the old kiddos. Let's get that out of here first. How about we do that? Let's do that instead. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Probably showing everything right now. <laughs> All right, so. Do this. Hold on just one minute. Oh, that was going on before and I knew it. Sorry, guys. One second. I gotta grab this. There we go. All right, sorry. All right, so here's these. Go down there. Whoops. Let's play and break them. I did. Well, then that's my bad. Okay. 
This is also for the treasure chest. This is a bubble blower. Looks like that. Give them something to do. I got this for my little granddaughter, Maddie. This is a bucket of the bucket, you know, with the water. And then you can use these little things right there. So I thought she'd have fun with that. Then I found this uh, swim ring and it is just the purple one. These are so much fun. These are the like the mini super soakers. So you stick this in the water, you draw the water, and you can splash it at people. So I got that made. All right. And who doesn't like squirt guns? Everybody likes a squirt gun. Let me get three of them. And my grand nephews will probably go crazy over that. Then I got this water ball sling shooter. Yeah. There's that. All right. And then I got these to use for some projects. Um, this is a three-piece button file bag. So you get three of them in there. That's a good, that's a very good deal. Is that the upside down? Yeah. All right. So, but... I found, I was looking for these, these are $8. These are for thick hair, and these are really, really thick, like heavy. Um, but I got these for my daughter, because I know with her hair, she got a lot of it. She needs it. So, All right, so then I found these Kiss Press-On Nails, no glue needed. And so they had the pink ones. I thought, you know what, I'm going to do up my nails for, the, you know, just, I have, I have nails in years. And those are pretty cute. All right. Then I found this auto eyeliner. It's black. Cruelty free. Smudge proof. LA colors. We're going to give that a little whirl. And then I told you I'm trying to replace my brushes. So I found this round blending brush. Um, looks like that. Then I found this crease brush by uh, Wet n Wild. Then this is the color that, um, this is the Melon Kiss by uh, Flower, which is Drew Barrymore's line. Let me see. Get this open. Let's see. Maybe. We'll see. Might just have to rip it apart. Da, 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 da. Are you serious? I have to have a degree to get into this box? All right, here we go. Oh, this is pretty. Look at that. Oh, I like that packaging so much. Oh, wow. This is a... Oh, you guys. Oh, I love this. So, it's a lipstick. Okay. So, that's the lipstick part of it. And then, they have a little lip gloss. How cute is that? There we go. I like it. Very pretty. I like the packaging. Good job. Mix and matte dual lip dual. Very cool. All right. So this is the eyeliner. This is a kind of like a brownish color. I got that. And then I got some more of these. These are for plants. This is a plant labels 10 piece. We already used some. This was so pretty. I found this, and this is what it looks like. This is a wall hanging. Doesn't that look pretty? I know exactly where I'm going to put it. And then I found this. Blessed. And I thought about doing this. What do you think? Give me your thoughts. We'll see what you think. Okay? All right. They have a new storage essentials three-section utensil caddy. I'll probably use it for somebody else, but I, something else. But I do like the idea of the utensils being in here. Um, it is a green briar. It looks like that. 
It's very, it's not the, pla it's not like that plastic that they have. This is very heavy duty. Nice. Okay, so then I had to get some of these uh, Equal Gang Bamboo Cotton Swabs. 150 pieces. There you go. Then they had this Tender Bake White Self-Rising Cornmeal Flour. You know what I could make out of this? I wonder if I could. I don't have to think about that for a minute. I like cornbread too. So it's like this, you guys. And that's a pretty good size. It's a two pounds. Yeah, pretty good size. All right, so let's see what we got right here. One second, you guys. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. All right, so then I found some more of these cups. are fun to have in the summertime. This is Hello Sweet Summer, and you get two cups with the straws. And this is Tropical Life. And I really like those a lot, too. So there you go. First your money, then you close it. My daddy always just like... And then we got some cotton swabs, or uh, rounds. And I got some cotton balls. All right, so then I found, I told you I found this uh, family, three pieces. And then friend. Then I've got this for my, um, they're using this for garden stuff, but I'm going to use this for my uh, broom and dustpan, things like that. And mop. Can't beat that, and they work really well. So, all right, and I'm getting close to being done. And this is the bathroom cleaner. I really like this bathroom cleaner a lot. It does a good job. And then, last but not least, this. Oh, I'm not done yet. Oh, oh wait a minute. I also found the stuffed puffs monster marsh, and I wish I would have bought more. They're individually wrapped. Okay, they look like that. Um, and so, I'm going to get this out. You see how that looks? I think those kids are going to have too much fun with that. Then I found these Cheez It grips, and you get six of them. I got those for my cake for his lunch. Then I found this was interesting. This is the toilet bowl cleaner packs. Okay, so it looks like that, and you get 10 of them by Tarred Water. Mineral deposits and soils and stains. Clean, fresh scent. So you're going to drop one tablet in the toilet bowl. Let the pack dissolve and work for approximately 10 minutes, then flush. There you go. We're going to give that a try. I'll let you know how that works. Then I've got, I've been buying a lot of these just because, you know, I need to have more in the summertime. There's those. These are the aloe vera. Yep, looks like that. And then these are the skin tone bandages. 30 of them. And then I got these. are going to be used for, I love these baskets. There's a lid for it too. You guys already know this. And I got two. <clears throat> then last but not least, I got this pot. And what I'm going to do is make it a butt can. Do you know what a butt can is? It's B-U-T-T -T for cigarette butts. I have some smokers that come over and they have to smoke outside. And I'm going to make a butt can. That's what I said, didn't I? Anyways, that is the haul, y'all. I hope you guys are having a fantabulous time off. Whatever you're doing. Whatever you're doing. Let me know what you guys are doing. What you're up to. What's new? What's the 411? I want you to like, comment, share, subscribe down below. Remember, snail mail, because everybody likes getting something good in mail besides a damn bill. I know I do. Do something good for yourself so you can do something good for somebody else. And above all else, what do I always say? Be good. I love you guys. Mwah.